This morning, a lot of high schools have already graduated their seniors. They sure have. Uh, so school is out for the summer, if you will. A lot of the kids looking for the summer job. Did yeah. you have one? I sure did. I worked at Gap Kids. I worked at a restaurant as a busboy. No way. Mm -hmm. We'll have to talk about that it was one later. Traumatic experience. So Marilee, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. Marilee Bruscaketti with Patrice and Associates is here to share tips on helping teenagers land a job. This is so important, right? It is. It's absolutely important. This is where you learn skills that are going yeah. to help you Agreed. in the future and where you're going to make contacts. And it starts to build that resume. Uh, and also, Absolutely. you're learning what you like and you don't like. You might not like working in a restaurant, but you might like working retail. Right. So that could lead to, to future. Right. But you brought up a good point. This is everything you're doing, and, and high schoolers especially are aware of this as they go into college. Everything's about getting something on your resume. Mm -hmm. So when you want to create a resume, we at Patrice and Associates always say the best thing to do is create an accomplishment-based resume. Okay. Uh, you don't want to just say, here's what I like, here are my objectives, here are my skills. You want to tell them what you've actually accomplished so that they know that you're a person who sets goals and achieves them. Okay, you're 15, 16 years old. You've, you're going out for your first job. Uh, whether it's at a restaurant, retail, babysitting, you don't have a resume per se to hand over. How do you make an impression? How do you get that employer to give you a chance on your first job? Well, there are five steps to any great interview to get a good job. Um, first of all, pick the right one. So find one that you know is going to help you get those skills. It's always learn, not earn when you're starting out. So look for that. I do recommend doing a resume, even for high schoolers coming out. You can put together a resume with Maybe you stuck with um, Taekwondo and got your black belt. That shows you achieved goals. Great. And you were on a team. Uh, everyone's been on a team at some point. You're a team worker. Mm -hmm. So there are ways to do that. And it's a leave behind as well so that they look. Uh, but the first step is do your research. Any company you interview for, do your research online. Mm -hmm. Go to visit it if it's a retail establishment or a restaurant so you can talk about it. And that's going to help you express why you want to work there. Number two is big passion for why you want to work at that particular place. Never say, why do you want to work? I don't know. Because it pays <laughs> My mom's money. making me. <laughs> yeah. yeah, exactly. Because we love Just it here. Because you love it there, what yes. social media? I was chatting with someone uh, who said that uh, when she was applying for college, they were looking at her social media. Do, um, do employers look at social media? And, they absolutely and what the kids are do. posting? Yeah, it's a fact growing up now with your life on display. So make sure you have your settings correctly. You know, make sure that it isn't that there are pictures, maybe incriminating pictures. Okay. You don't want them public. Yeah. Just make sure you have that Real set. quick, we're, you're, you're a fountain of information here this morning, but unfortunately we're running out of time. One last mm -hmm. question. You know, when I was looking for my job, we looked at, through the local paper at the classifieds. They don't really have that yeah, anymore. Where do you What's go? the best place to do? Really, it's door to door. Find places. Oh. You know, in the summer here in Arizona, a lot of out of state college kids are going back home. So there are openings. So go knock on doors, walk in, have your resume ready, dress for success. Yeah, that don't, was. That That's was exactly important. with no jeans and t-shirts. No jeans and t-shirts. Dress, Dress the like the manager or whoever is above them so that you show you're really responsible awesome. and, and interested. How do people get a hold of you if they need more information? Oh, they can contact me at Marilee Bruce. Uh, it's either Marilee Bruce Eschetti at patriceandassociates.com. Never going to be able to spell that. <laughs> or go to the website All at right. Patrice and Associates. Slash Arizona. All right. Never too early to start. Yeah. yeah. We you. appreciate it. Thanks so much. Some really Thank good information out there. We'll be right back, everyone.